<laughs> okay, guys, uh, welcome back to Let's Play uh, Paper Mario. That's what we're playing, so wait a minute here. The last video, when it ended, I had, I think, 20 HP, 50 star points. I don't know how many coins, you can't see that. But, and now I have 68 star points and full HP. Just some off screen grinding and healing, right? <laughs> no. Yeah. This is the cardinal plant. Or well, that's what I call it. <laughs> yeah. Here's what happened. I started recording part 36. Um, well, what was originally going to be part 36. And, well, we can keep sushi. And I died. I died. Okay. So, yeah, I died. Like, I wasn't even paying attention to my HP. I guess I was just talking about something else. And I died. So I had to do a bunch of this stuff again, and I thought, well, if I'm doing it again... Oh, that would have been a good time for me to show you Power Quake. Oh, well. You know, we'll just make this take four turns. Yeah, these things, if you get used to it, you can dodge them. For some reason, it's more satisfying to dodge this guy than more than any other guy in the game. And just so you know, their attack power is not two, it's three. I keep forgetting that I'm wearing the damage dodge badge. I'm like, I don't remember these guys having such low attack power. It's because I've never been wearing the damage dodge badge before. Yeah, even with the damage dodge badge, I still died. So, ooh, we got, we got it. All the spell powers run out. Oh God. That's probably just going to be something I do off screen. I'll probably do it after chapter 5 since I don't want to leave this island while I'm here. Lazy. Yeah. You in the background, shut up. Okay. So, basically we're rescuing the first Yoshi kid. 12 star points. Oh, poor Yoshi. Oh, no, that's right, he's in the bush. Aww. It's Red Yoshi. <laughs> yep. I wonder what 900 Red Yoshi will say when he gets to that part in his LP. Hmm. Like, oh, it's me! Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there's no character in a video game named Luke. Well, yeah, there is. In Pokemon Diamond Pearl Platinum, there is. I'm sorry I even remember that. Much less I actually remember what Pokemon he has. He has a Snover and a Ryolu. Yeah. And he's a Black Belt. Okay. So, so yeah, these M. Bush. I don't know why they call them M. Bush. Oh, I, I know why they call them M. Bush. It's a play on words of ambush. Of course. I never even knew that until just now. But they're a bush, so. Get it? The thing about uh, M. Bushes is they always will respawn since they're bushes. Yeah, we already saw what Goombario had to say about those. Oh, one more thing before I forget. While I was going through this whole thing again, remember that island the star piece was on? And I said if you hit that tree, it would just be a fuzzy? No, it wouldn't. It, there's actually a letter in that tree. Let's check it out. Items. Key items. Let's hear this one. To Rust Tea in Toad Town. That, get, that will get us a star piece. So I guess there's two star pieces you can get on that island. And, uh, let's see what Kumbaria has to say about this one. It's a munch... Munchlesia. It grows only on Rabba Lava Island. If you jump on it, it'll wrap you tight and take some of your health. This is the one I was talking about. And that's probably my favorite Mario facial expression in the game. Yeah, you can fight these ambushes if you want. Ambush! I get ambush, because, you know, it's a hunter, it's prize as prey. I'm so sorry. So, after you get your first Yoshi kid, it takes him a while to get the first one, but after that, you can get the other ones pretty quick. And this is the guy I died on last time. 
because you have to fight. We're gonna fight a new enemy here because we didn't actually get to fight them before. The fuzzies. And last time I was here, I didn't have enough uh, star power to use Star Storm, but now I do. Basically, those fuzzies. Here's how it works. Um. Instead of, you know how regular fuzzies, like the fuzzies and the frog fuzzies? Well, no, they're not like that. They, like, continuously suck your HP, but you have to, like, keep tapping A to get them off. And I've never been able to get them to do less than four damage. And for that reason, just the way they attack, that means that damage dodge actually does not work. Uh, would defend plus work? I think defend plus would work. So we're in a dark room. I wonder what Goombario would say about this, see? Like these rooms that you go in like once, you gotta see what he'd say. I bet only jungle explorers know about this hidden underground chamber. It's so dark in here, I can't see a thing. Oh, no, sushi's not gonna help us. Not even if we're hungry. And there's our second Yoshi kid. It was this flower that spun around, and I thought it was way cool, so I got on it. And then I spun around and around, and I ended up in the air and flying, I ended up here, I didn't know how to get here. When he said, way cool, he sounded like Sonic the Hedgehog. But when he continued, he didn't sound so much like Sonic. Speaking of Sonic the Hedgehog, no, I'm not going to say that right now, I have to wait. As much as I want to talk about Sonic Cause coming up game, <laughs> Um, I'm gonna wait until I actually make my E3 response. So, these things, you hit them. Ah! Oh, come on, please tip the other way. Oh, thank goodness. Seriously. So now, to Yoshi Kid. We should tattle him. Oh, sniff, sniff. We were playing hide and seek. I had to be it, but I couldn't find anyone at all. I wandered around and I got lost. You were right, Sushi. Jungle's really scary. Mario can be it for now on. Yeah. Well, thanks a lot. You know, you could have helped us. Um, oh, that's the one the fuzzy comes out of. Okay. Maybe I can show you how you're actually supposed to fight these guys. Yeah, there's only two of them, so. Also, they have two attacks. Well, technically they have two. They have their one attack. And they can also make a copy of themselves. Okay, they're not. So press A repeatedly. Whoa! It only did two damage! That's the first time it's ever done anything less than four. And my first time it attacks me on screen. First time ever it's done anything less than four. So if I'd done that, I wouldn't have died. Level up! That was a fast level up. Of course, because you guys didn't... I had, like, 20 star points off screen. I think it's time for FP. Yes, it is. I might equip the HP plus for the boss. Like I said, the boss... Oh! Is that another star piece? What the flag? What the flag is going on? Okay. Maybe... Good lord. I did not know. And by the way, did I even mention this yet? If I hadn't mentioned this yet, that would be, like, terrible. So I guess I'll kind of talk about it while I'm fighting this guy. The ambush. I'm not going for all the star pieces in the game. Well, I mean, I am. Obviously, that's why I'm looking for them, but you might be saying, why not? I mean, I'm not I, I'm not actually going to have, like, say, 100%. I'm just going to find everyone that's not a Chuck Quizmo. I still might do Koopa Coot, but not Chuck Quizmo. That'll be way too tedious. I mean, if I see him, I'll talk to him. But I'm not going to, like, go all out of my way. And I, I still do plan to do Koopa Coot, probably right before Chapter 8. Because that's when you can do everything you can. And I think that's a bad one. You know, I've had enough optional touch and bite. Uh-huh. Always take care of the fuzzy first. Well, that's what I said back when I knew it could do, like, a bunch of attack. But, you know, I don't like tapping buttons over and over. 
But it's better than rotating the control stick like you have to do in Mario Party. And that thing where you have to see how much you can rotate the control stick in five seconds. Or that the mini game. And who guess who runs the mini game? A shy guy. So this is what you get. So uh, I think that's gonna be the end. No, we still got a good 30 seconds. Hmm, that looks like the entrance to something. <gasps> please don't fall, please don't fall, please don't fall on me! Hmm. Oh, it's a hurt plant. I'll beat him off screen. Next video will start, like, after the battle's over.